From his personal relationships to different hobbies and interests, there's a lot of information about Randy Orton that WWE fans might not know about. Randy Orton is one of the most decorated WWE superstars of all time, having captured 14 world championships amongst many across the mid card and tag team division. People are well aware of who the Viper is due to his Hall of Fame career, but there's a lot about his life outside the business that people still are still aware of after these years. Join us now to look at 10 interesting things fans don't know about Randy Orton's life outside the business. Be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell to see more videos. Number 10. Originally not liking Matt Riddle. In recent times before his latest injury, Randy you know, enjoyed working in the tech team division alongside Matt Riddle and together, the two of them have become incredibly popular in the WWE phase. Even though they are an unconventional pairing, they ended up having great chemistry. While they are now genuinely friends, that wasn't always the case. Orton used to dislike former NXT star because Riddle didn't show enough respect towards him when he first came to the main roster. Number 9. Acting Opportunities Red Orton is someone who puts professional wrestling first ahead of everything else, which is something that has helped him to create an incredible legacy. Despite his focus being on his in-ring work, Orton has still had opportunities outside of the business, particularly when it comes to acting. It's something that a lot of wrestlers have started to do now, from John Cena to Edge, and Odon is another one of these. He might not have been in too many major projects yet, but everything he has done has shown that he can be a success. Number 8. Close Friendship with Kurt Angle Ron Orton has been in the business for a long time, and throughout those years, he has been able to get to work with a large number of wrestling legends. One person he had great matches with was Kurt Angle, and the two of them have forged a great friendship together over time. A large part of that is down to their current wives, as they are genuinely best friends, who have become very close due to their time backstage, so much so they now have their own podcast together. That has kept Orton and Engel close together over the years, as well which is something many people don't know about. Number 7. Arguing with the rapper Now Orton has always been aware of the fact that he is a hot-headed person, with this being particularly true during his youth. While he doesn't cause issues behind the scenes in WWE anymore, he is still happy to call people out on social media when he deems it applicable. That led to him having an online argument with famous rapper Soja Boy on Twitter. The musician has slammed wrestling by calling it fake, which is something Otto decided to hold him accountable for and led to a break and forth between them. Number 6. He has his own bus. Len Otto has been around in the business for a long time, and because of that, he has put in plenty of hours when it comes to travel. As he becomes more experienced, the Viper has tweaked certain elements of his life to ensure that things are even more comfortable. That is why he got his own tour bus, which eliminates the element of having to drive or being cranked inside a car regularly. That is something that only a few top level wrestlers have, like Romerens, simply down to expense of them, but Red Orton is one of them. Number 5. He is a gamer. Video gaming has begun a popular hobby for those in the wrestling industry in recent years, especially with the rise of online streaming. The likes of Xavier Woods and Adam Cole have thrived by sharing their passion by playing video games and interacting with others while they do it. However, that is the first time that a lot of people likely didn't expect that Randy Orton would also be interested in. However, the Viper is an avid video gamer, who also spends his time playing video games, even sharing some of that content on Twitch himself. Number 4. A Family Man Randy Orton is often showcased as a very serious person inside the ring, particularly because he has played a view for the vast majority of his career. However, Behind the scenes in real life, the WWE veteran has turned into an excellent family man, with this being something he is incredibly proud of. At times in his youth, a few people would have expected Odon to have become a proud husband and father, but that is something that has helped him mature, adding a lot of his life outside of the ring. Number 3. His brother is in comedy. The Odon family is firmly attached to the professional wrestling industry, with Red Odon's father and grandfather both being legends from their own eras. However, while the brother didn't follow in those footsteps, but that doesn't mean he didn't get the entertainment bug. Rather than following people inside the ring, Nathan Orton has a career in stand-up comedy, which is something that a lot of wrestling fans aren't aware of. Number 2. Suffers from a Red Orton has put together a long wrestling career, 
but he has dealt with a lot of injury problems throughout that. Many of them have silenced him for a very long time, which has been a shame to see, but a lot of those problems have been turned to an underlying issue he has. That is because Otto suffers from hypermobility in his shoulders, which is something that has caused the problems not just in the ring, but throughout his everyday life as well. Number 1. Apparel Otto has a huge fan base, and that is something he and his family have tapped into by launching their own apparel line known as Striking Style with Randy and Kim. This obviously taps into Otto's nickname of the Viper and it features a range of different clothing for people to purchase. This is primarily Kim Otto's company, but Randy has become a big part of it, sharing the products and often working as a model to take pictures to promote them, even wearing them for WWE appearances. But there you go guys, a list of 10 things fans don't know about Randy Don't forget to smash the like button and subscribe if you haven't. Until then, see you next time.